What's up guys? Figured I'd make this quick video about wrestling otaku because he wants to talk a bunch of shit and pretend to be some big macho dude he's really fucking not. So, first off, I just want to talk about all of wrestling otaku's bullshit about women. He's a fucking complete joke. He's obviously a virgin. He's never been with a woman for the past, mm, I'd say 10 or 15 years, and he's definitely never fucking had sex with them. So it's kind of funny how he sits here acting like he's a fucking pimp, and he knows everything about women, and then makes these long video diatribes, talking about how women aren't good enough for him, and they're all stuck up, and he's not gonna change for anyone. I mean, he's a fucking joke. He's so fucking fat. It's ridiculous. He never changes his clothes. He's always wearing the same gross Naruto shirt in every one of his fucking videos. Or the disgusting brown collar shirt he wears to work every day of his fucking life. But even if he was dressed nice, no woman wants such a fat, sloppy, gross asshole. And you do act like an asshole. You act like an asshole. You think being confident means being a jackass, but that's not what being confident is. Being confident is being sure of yourself and not having to pretend to be so much cooler than you fucking are. That's what women want. That's why you can't find a woman, because you're a complete fake loser. But that's really only one of your many, many issues. You pretend to be this big tough guy and pick fights online, fights that you can't actually back up. All you do is report people and block them and then cry and make videos going, I win, I win, I'm the big otaku who won. You're not, you're just a crybaby who wants to block people and hide your head in the sand and pretend you're fucking killing it when you're not. You have a really shitty channel. It's got 3.2 thousand viewers over eight years of trying. That's not success. That's just really, really poor, poor performance. And then you get a couple hundred views on your videos because no one wants to watch your shitty opinions. People only care when you produce cringe content. So you make these cringe videos talking about women aren't good enough because you think it's going to generate clicks and generate some kind of fame for you. But everybody's just fucking laughing at you because you're a joke. And then these people come to your house, and you want to pay, I'm the big man, I wasn't scared of you guys, when you were obviously fucking scared. You were terrified, and you almost shit yourself when they asked if you do YouTube videos. Because you're a big fucking fake loser. That's what you are. You're a giant phony who makes these videos pretending to be a big tough guy, being cool for your little wrestling friends who, by the way, all look like fucking predators. Just like you. But that's really an aside, because these are the only fucking people in the world that would ever look at you and go, oh man, that guy's cool, I want to be like him, because you're a joke. Every normal person looks at you and goes, this guy's a fucking idiot, he's a lol cow, he's making a fool of himself online every day, and he thinks this is success. Because yeah, it's probably a little more success than the shitty part-time job you have, but it's not success. It's making an ass out of yourself in front of the world and going, why doesn't anybody think I'm fucking cool? Because you're not. You're a joke. And your anime reviews make you look like such a fucking child. You review high schooler anime. You're 30 something years old and you have an obsession with high schoolers. It's gross. It's disgusting. You're gross. You're disgusting. That's why no one likes you. That's why everyone laughs at you. That's why people talk about you. That's why everyone's gonna continue talking about you because you make yourself out to be a giant joke. And that's what you will be for the rest of your fucking life, Wrestling Otaku. So just remember that and remember that every night when you go to bed alone, which you will do for the rest of your life, that the only reason your life sucks is because of you. Because you're a piece of shit.